Hi everyone, this is Laura and I have a few announcements, some car shares, some information and lots to catch up on with you guys. First, let me start off by saying Happy New Year to all my YouTube family and friends. Um, I hope you all bring in the new year with um, a lot of happiness and joy and also in good health. Um, we sometimes forget how important that is, I think. The other announcement I wanted to make was that I have received my DT package from Source Deluxe. Thank you, Lucy. Um, I will be a guest designer for Lucy for the month of January. And so I will hope you guys are able to watch that. I sorry if I sound very rushed, guys. I haven't been able to load any videos for the last two weeks. Um, there's just been lots of things going on at home. Um, I don't know if you can hear my stuffy nose. But, um, yeah, we had some colds. I had some family stuff that I had to take care of. And then, of course, you add the holidays into that mix, and it's just been crazy. So I want to apologize to all my friends that I have not responded to yet um, for watching my videos the last couple of weeks. I haven't posted anything in a bit. But there were some videos that I had posted a few weeks ago that you left me the most beautiful comments. I have not been able to reply to anyone as of yet. And I do apologize for that. I'm just running like really, really late. Um, I want to share some cards with you guys. And I also want to thank all my beautiful scrappy family and friends that sent me items. Thank you so much. That was so super sweet of you. I am sorry I have not been able to make these videos until now. And if I am rushed, it's with good reason. I apologize for that too because we have a major blizzard coming to the northeast um, today. And um, chances are I will be losing power again. And it, may, it can be anywhere from three days to a week before we get um, power back on. So during that time, I am not able to watch videos, comment videos, or make videos. I am so sorry. So I want to try to get this up and out of the way because I've been holding um, holding back on my videos already long enough. It's been like, um, I don't know. It's it's just been crazy. I called. Um, I was even telling one of my girls here on YouTube. I don't know. It's like a big black cloud over me. And... Uh, I did say thank you to Lucy for asking me to be a guest designer for the month of January. I will also be a guest designer for Heather Ideas to Come for the month of February. So be on the lookout for that. Um, I have a few more Diamond Dyes uh, projects to share with you guys. And also, I have some beautifulness. I have someone that has been on my mind now. I just saw her video. And that's Miss Nurse Laurel, who's Suzanne. And she sent me this most beautiful card. Um, I love this. I don't know where she got this from. But this is adorable to me. Um, I just also got a phone call that my kids are going to be let out of school. Um, very early. You know, guys, I don't understand this. They know we're going to get about anywhere from 8 to 13, maybe even 18 inches of snow. My girls have to get up at 5.30 in the morning. And I've been up since then with them, making sure that they dress warm to go to school. They go to school. They start school at 7 o'clock. And then they turn around and send them back home at 10 o'clock. Why make them go to school for three hours? I have no clue. But their school is already done. They're already on the way home. It, it, it's just crazy. Just me venting. That's all. Sorry. I just don't get it. Why not just leave them home and let them stay in bed where, where it's nice and warm? Well, anyway, um, Suzanne, uh, I really, really love this here. I would love to know, is this um, a dye or is this... A stamp or is it something from your cricket or your silhouette? Love it. And then look at the cute little deer that she put here. She little chalk here and a little holly. I just love your card. Um what I was gonna say was um I had asked Suzanne 
about an embellishment she used on her project and she was super sweet to pick some up for me and this is what they look like and this is what I really fell in love with aren't these a gorgeous and this these are them Shh. be quiet so she was kind enough to pick some up for me. I thought there was someone at the door. I'm so sorry, guys. But anyways, um, and I just thought that was the sweetest thing ever. And she told me, hey, don't even worry about it. I'll just pick some up when I go again. And I'll send some your way. And she did. So thank you, um, Suzanne, for that. Also, I saw your video, girl. And I sent you a message. And I just want to tell you. Shh. I just want to send you a very, very big hug because um, you just sounded like you really needed a very big hug in your last video. And honey, we have all been there um, at one point or another. Um, sometimes we just need to vent and talk to our friends and be, you know, I, I just... I felt what you were trying to say and I just want you to know you are not alone and if you ever need a friend to talk to Suzanne I am so here for you girl so just know that we here love you and I hear where you're coming from I, I just I don't want to say too much other than that okay I know that you are in my thoughts and you are also in my prayers and this I'm actually scared <laughs> to, to, <laughs> to share this one with you. This comes from one of my, um, I don't even, what, what, what words do I use for you, Miss Vicky? Um, besides her being a sister from, uh, I already took a peek. Yes, I did. Besides her being my sister from another Miss Sister and one of the most down to earth, lovable, squishable, kissable, females I have ever met besides the fact that she has the most amazing sense of humor um, her and I clicked right from the very beginning and for those of you who don't know who I'm talking about I am talking about Miss Vicky um, her name is me love Bono here on YouTube but I'm gonna start calling her my love Bono <laughs> because she is my little love here on YouTube and look it she got washi tape that says Merry Christmas. I've never seen washi tape that says Merry Christmas. And look what she got me. I didn't even open my card yet, but this kind of peeked out. Yes. And Vicky, honey, can I tell you how many times I almost bought this? Yeah, she sent me a Christmas present. And it's a Bonnie. She's very Bonnie. Very bunny indeed. Mucho bono. Oh, she, well, my Vicky knows I love two things more than anything. One would be mermaids and the other one is fairies. And I love her. I love her. I love her. I love her. Not as much as I love you, Vicky, but I love her. You know, I was almost scared to make this video because I don't know if you guys see <laughs> Vicky's channel. <laughs> but, um... She was uh, making videos and commenting and remarking on the packages that she sent out some of her girls. And um, I don't even know what she's going to say when she sees this video or what she's going to say about me. But <laughs> here I is. I am brave. I did it anyways. Now, not that I don't love this. And I'm going to be a little bit of a Weisenheimer now because I know she's going to get me. I love her. Yes, I do. And I can't wait to make something pretty with her and show you. And maybe I even send it to you. And I'm going to open my card. And I know I'm going to love my card too. But I like this. How come you didn't send me none of this? <laughs> yeah. Ungrateful little witch, ain't I? Yeah, but this. Look at this. I want me some of that. That is gorgeous. So, um, Vicky, I don't know if you saw, but you were the inspiration for my window card. Oh, I think you did see it. I'm pretty sure you saw it. 
and um, she always inspires me and she doesn't um, like to take credit for being an amazing card maker but she is she I'm always learning from her and you know what Vicky honey you may not put 20,000 pounds of crap on your stuff like I do but yours is a simple a beautiful elegance to your stuff and you may not think you don't have the girly girl thing here covered but you do and just to give you an example of what I'm talking about look at this gorgeous pin that she made for me look at the beauty and the colors yep look at how pretty and then to put it here with the little ivies and the glittery tool and the doily I mean come on it's beautiful simple beautiful and elegant and made from the heart and I love her look at she look at glitter on those ivy leaves I am loving these ivy leaves girl <coughs> excuse me a session second oh I give you big kisses yeah, me too, honey. But you know what? I'm awful grateful I have you in my life now. Yep, she says she loves me. And she says she wishes we would have met when we were younger and healthier so we can, you know, paint the town red and create lots of havoc. I added the last part about painting the town red and creating lots of havoc. Um, I definitely do wish we lived closer. And I definitely wish we talked more. But Vicky, if we talked any more, girl, I mean, I need a phone with a 10-hour charger. <laughs> and that's the only reason. Listen, guys, when her and I talk on the phone, the only reason our conversation stops is because our phone dies. Yeah, I have to get, uh, you know, I have to. That's the only way to get me off the phone when I'm on the phone with her. Well, honey, I just want to say. Thank you so much, not only for my um, stamp and my beautiful card, not only for your amazing friendship and making me smile all the time, even at my worst, but also Vicky sent my girls um, two gifts, which they already tore up, used up, broke into. And I don't know um, anyone that is so similar to me like Vicky. I mean, we're like old school girls. And my mom used to always say that you can tell people um, what kind of people some people are by the way they treat their parents and kids. And I just thought that was super duper nice of you to remember those girls, my two girls. And they went totally to town and they said to thank their Aunt V because that's what they call you. They call you Aunt V. And they said, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for all the beautifulness. And like I said, that was just super, super sweet of you. You brought tears to my eyes. Um, but I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that. <laughs> so, honey, I will be calling you soon. And um, if I don't call you today, it's probably because my lights, and my electricity went out. And... Um, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get my cell phone up as well. So anyways, you stay tuned to that. Now, my next card is from Miss Cool Cat. And this is my birthday twin. I don't know if you guys remember, Laura and I have the same names and the same birthdays. And that intrigued me so that I had to reach out to her. And we've had a few birthday swaps already. And I sent her some goodies here and there. Um, and I have built the most amazing friendship. Now, guys, look at this tape. Ah, isn't that cute? Sharon, look, owls. I think I'm going to have to save this just to use it on a project for Sharon. So, Laura, honey, um, I am so sorry that I have not sent your card out yet. Like I said, I had lots of, lots of stuff going on at home. Excuse me, guys. And I've had... So many crazy things happening, and I would love to show you how cute she decorated her envelope, but her address is on it, and I really can't. But maybe if I went like this. She's an amazing artist as well. There you go. Isn't that cute? Look at that. 
I love it. She is an amazing artist, guys. And her name is Miss Cool Cat. She plays with a lot of media and doodling. And she is just my girl. I mean, I love her to death. And look how beautiful is her card. I love this. I need to get me something like this embossing Merry Christmas stuffy stuffy here. I just love this gorgeous card. And she has a few goodies that she put in here for me. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love this, Laura. Oh, how pretty. I've never seen these before. Oh my goodness. Look at how cute they are. <coughs> so she sent me some of those. And she sent me some flares, which I love because I don't have too many. I only have the ones Vicky sent me, actually. And I've been hoarding those. I have them in my happy vault. I used a few, but there's about three or four still in my happy vault. So I am loving these. Thank you so much. Oh, my goodness. I left my card open here. Well, let me see. Oh, thank you, my love. I always have you in my thoughts and prayers to you and your family. And I, I am sure hoping that your dad is in a much um, better spirit and place and stuff. And she also sent me some beautiful poinsettias. And these are gorgeous. It says Irene's Garden. Bag of six. <sighs> gorgeous thank you so much sweetie i am so touched that you thought of me and i want to thank you so much for these beautiful heartfelt goodies um girl i love you and i i am with you um although laura and i don't speak very often because she has been very very busy um dealing with a lot of stuff at home and in her you know in her busy life. You are always, always, Laura, in my thoughts and prayers. You're an amazing woman. You're an amazing friend. And hey, you're my 20. <laughs> Thank you, honey. Thank you so much for that. I love you right back, girl. And this one is from Marissa, who is Creative Young Mama. And she is one of my girls as well. She's so super funny and she's so pretty. And very talented. And this is a card from her and her family. Can you see how gorgeous that woman is? She is beautiful. And if there was ever someone that I would love to meet and just spend a day with, you know, just go out a girl day shopping, lunching, it's you, baby girl, my chinita. That's what I call her. And she has such a beautiful, handsome family. God bless you all, Marissa. I hope you have a happy, happy new year. And I hope you had a wonderful Christmas. Many blessings to you, to Malaya, to Marley, and to Pharaoh. Yes, I hope you all have the best of the holiday season. Look at how pretty is her girls. Gorgeous. Thank you, love. And my last one for now because I'm already into this so much, is from my other sweetie pie. This is from Barbara. And, oh, I can't show you the other side, because the other side has the address. But she said she just wanted to drop a little note to wish us a happy and happy New Year and a Merry Christmas. And look at how beautiful she made her own um, postcards. Isn't this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous? I love it. Thank you, Barbara. Many blessings to you too, my love. Mwah, mwah. Hugs and kisses to everyone. And I am going to stop here, guys. Um, my last little announcement for today is this. Um, a few weeks ago, I had gotten some really, really bad news from my eye doctor. Um, apparently, there's a special test that they give people um, to, to measure the pressure in their eyes and I failed my test and among other telltale signs and traits um, 
there was a good chance that they thought that I had glaucoma, which scared the living pants off me. And I had to go to see a specialist. And I just want to tell all my friends who have been asking and praying for me, um, it is not glaucoma. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you so much, my heavenly father. But, um, I do have something else going on with my eyes and it's going to require that I take medicine now, probably for the rest of my days. Um, but, and it is related to my illness. Um, but it is not glaucoma. And I just wanted to say thank you to all my friends who messaged me and who heard me mention it and who um, kept me in their prayers, kept me in the thoughts. Um, one lady in particular, um, and I'm not going to say her name right now, but she also suffered um, some loss in her family during that time of my doctor's appointment. And she had me in her prison and in her thoughts all day. And I cannot tell you with all the crap that she, well, oh, did I say the word crap? I am so sorry. But with all the stuff she was going on in her personal life at home, she actually was thinking of me that day and sent me some more wishes. And girl, you know who you are. I thank you for that. That touched me so you don't even know. Um, and it's the love and the prayers and the well wishes that I believe why I was blessed with um, not having this illness. So thank you for that. Thank you all for putting up with my jabber jabber announcements and for listening to me and for all my craziness. And believe it or not, guys, I still have more packages and cards to share. So I'm going to let you go because I have to get these things on camera for my friends. Otherwise, the snow might come and get me. <laughs> I'll talk to you soon. Um, have a blessed day. Bye for now.